What's going on, everybody? It's a YouTube Troy, aka Papa Birdo, and I'm here to talk about the new scan with Konohamaru and Iruka. And the only thing I gotta say is that Subakunit 2 is doing a really good job so far with the roster, anyways. Uh, you know, you guys were calling Kurina, well, I said Kurina, oh my god, Kushina. You guys were calling Kushina like a joke character and such, and now they added Iruka on there. Konohamaru is actually, to me, he's like a serious character, personally. Uh, but Iruka is more like a joke character. And you know what? The fact that they're announcing these characters now kind of tells me that they're saving the good shit for later. For when the game is closer to the release date, you know what I'm saying? And I I'm actually hyped about that more than the scan itself. Uh, you know, I was actually thinking about, damn man, what combos could they incorporate in Kon Konohamaru and Iruka? And I was thinking of all this shit and I was like, oh man, like, oh no, my brain just went somewhere else, man. And I'm actually pretty excited for these characters because obviously it, it extends the roster that much more. And it just, there's more hope for revolution for the multiplayer and like, you know, in the lifespan of it anyways. Because as you guys may know, after three or four months, um, Generations got boring, Storm 3 got boring. And I don't want that to happen with revolution. I want it to be a game where it's like really fun for a long time. And I believe that by them standing the characters with, with all these other characters that would never be on a Storm game otherwise, it would actually help. Because obviously, a lot of people are fans of different characters, and just having that that long, that big variety of characters is, is good for the game. And um, I really hope they incorporate Asuma's Jutsu into um, Konohamaru, like in a combo or a tilt or something. And they had the, the Shuriken clone Jutsu for him because I actually, that was actually pretty nice on the on the movie when they showed him uh, against Naruto. For Iruka, I don't know what they could do honestly. And on the screenshot, I didn't really see what he was doing. It looked kind of weird to me. Like the ultimate Jutsu for him looked weird as shit. But regardless, this was a good scan. Hopefully, they announce something amazing on the next scan. Uh, and hopefully, we can see some gameplay trailers coming around. You know, because that's really what I want to see. But anyways, guys, I'm out. I'm going to go record uh, some live ranked. And uh, that's it. I'm out. Peace.